Hello everyone, David here with Monofit Training Systems. It is November. We're getting into those holiday party months where things can kind of go to shit pretty fast. Remember that um, it is always important to celebrate with family and however you choose to do that is up to you, but remember that these days are one day. So Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's is a day. Um, Try not to get too caught up in all the parties surrounding it and leading up to it um, so you don't derail your fitness. Do not wait until January 1st to start getting more and more fit or to start your journey towards fitness, whether it's for the first time or for the first time in a while. But just make sure that you are staying true to your goals. And what I'm going to do for you right now is a quick um, four exercise, 10 reps. Um, that you could probably knock out three to four rounds of this in less than 20 minutes. Um, if you're going for strength, pure strength, and it might take you a little bit longer if you need to take some breaks and you go real heavy. But the movements are um, 10 kettlebell swings, 10 two-handed kettlebell cleans, um, kettlebell press, and then kettlebell squat. And very straightforward movements, no talent or skill necessary. Um, if you don't have access to the heavier kettlebells, then of course, you know, find a small inexpensive gym if you uh, aren't already a member or if you're already on your fitness journey and you work out at home, you know, start to make that investment towards um, heavier kettlebells so that you can keep making progress. Now, one of the things on, uh, when it comes to fitness is you always want to do something that forces an adaptation or a change. So. I haven't done this sequence with a 40 before. I've done it with a 30, but I'm not really sure what to expect. But it's gonna challenge me, most likely. Always do things that are gonna make you uncomfortable, but never you know, lead to an injury. Um, working out for fitness, there's, the stakes are not high, meaning it's not like you're trying to get ready for some kind of competition. So don't push too hard, but push enough where you know that you just kinda handed yourself a little ass whoop in there. Um, so make it challenging. Um, and always find a weight that will force you to adapt in some way, whether it's your cardio or your strength or something like that. So I'm going to go ahead and knock this out real quick and let's see how it goes. All right, you can see, or maybe you couldn't see, but challenged my core for sure. Definitely challenged some cardio. Might get a little bit more creative. Might add something to that on the next one, but give that one a try. Three to four rounds, make sure you're warmed up. It's always okay to start a little bit lighter and then go heavier as you uh, get more and more warmed up. Take care.